I just had a great idea. What's mm -hmm. your great idea, Megan? You guys should wear and style wigs for a week. Um, you can. Y'all are some style icons for real. I feel like it'd be a really good challenge to your guys' fashion expertise. Five days. Five? It's sweaty. Wait, I'm kind of scared. We're gonna go wig shopping. Okay. okay. You're gonna get three different wigs. Okay. One that is the opposite of the hair you currently have. The second wig that I want you guys to get is something that you think that you could never pull off. Okay, okay. And then something that you're like, this is my dream hair. Oh, okay. Wow, I like these little Wait, I like it. Let's go to the wig store. All right. Okay. Doing. I think that people start wearing wigs for a lot of different reasons. It can just be a fun thing, like a different pair of shoes. But I do want to talk about, for a lot of people, it's not a choice or like it has a big meaning. I started wearing wigs because I was diagnosed with colon cancer. And I started losing a lot of my hair and I didn't feel great about myself. So I wanted a wig to like boost the confidence and make me feel like a normal person again. Being a woman of color and being a black woman, wigs and extensions and just doing amazing things with their hair is like definitely part of the community. I'm excited to see like what what new things I can make my look. I was super apprehensive when you asked because just knowing you, Megan, and knowing what you've been through and then knowing Jazz and her teaching me about all the cultural implications of hair in the black culture, I just didn't want to come in and be like, I'm here to have fun. Obviously, celebrities wear wigs, like, all yeah. the time, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know? So this is something You don't that... have to have, like, a difficult or sad reason to wear yeah, a wig. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. I'm excited to try the wigs on. That part's gonna be fun, but wearing them to work and living my life every day, I that's know. gonna be hard. You know me. I don't like doing challenges where I can't be myself. I know. And this is gonna feel very much not like me. What if it comes off? What if my wig is flown? I love that. <laughs> oh no. Today is the first day. We're starting off with our favorite wigs. I am really struggling with what to wear today. I don't know why I'm having such a hard time figuring this out. Got the uh, favorite wig on. <laughs> I tried my best here with the styling. You know, if it's purple, I'm just gonna go all out. I did orange pants and my crazy 90s platforms. I don't know, I love this outfit. I'm like digging it. I'm excited to take a photo today. I don't even know how to vlog because I feel like this is not me. I don't know if this is, this used to be my favorite wig, but now I'm just uh, hating everything about myself. I don't like how your first reaction is laughing at me. <laughs> We have so many colors. It yeah. Like a cartoon character. And that about yeah. Like, like, you know how like a Nickelodeon? Yeah, like like Nickelodeon if Doug girl. in real life was yeah. after you would be like, no, but not that way. It was just very cartoon like. That stings with the hair. I like it. You think so? Yeah. yeah. I like it's it because you accompany the shades with it. So I feel like yeah. I like I had to go into full on like I'm a star or I'm somebody's manager. <laughs> what do you think? Who is she? I thought it was your hair. From really? Yeah. It looks good. I love this color on you. Yeah, it's really nice. purple, but you're wrong. <laughs> but I'm wrong. Yeah, well, Ryan laughed at me and said he didn't like it. It looks good. funny. Not funny. It looks good. <laughs> I am a little self-conscious just because it's not me. Like I still feel like me, but I don't. I didn't know my hair color change would make such an impact on how I feel, but it really does. Who's this sitting at Jasmine's desk? Oh! Every time you have long hair, I just feel like you look like a news anchor or something. I know, that's like, great. Suddenly you've joined a sorority. <laughs> I feel like a combination of Patrick Star and Lizzo. <laughs> yeah! So I'm gonna try to channel their confidence. Who am I a child of? <laughs> Billie Eilish? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Be my mom, You're Billie, Billie Eilish's older sister, who's just a little off. A li <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> this was my first time wearing a wig for an entire day, mm -hmm. and it went pretty much exactly how I thought 
which was a little uncomfortable. I'm not as uncomfortable as I was at the beginning of the day. So yeah, same. Um, I, I feel better. We'll see how it tomorrow brings. We're wearing our hair today that is the opposite of us, which is basically everything for me because I don't have hair. I'm running so late today to work because it took so long to figure out what to freaking put with this brunette wig, which should be the easiest to style, but for some reason I was having the hardest time. And honestly, I just kind of settled on going just full punk. This is the wig. It goes all the way down here. Listening to vinyls in my spare time. Still listens to MCR. I don't know. Um, but I mean, to be honest, I'm digging it. I put on my outfit, which is honestly just a mesh and some biker shorts. I'm really, really trying to be more positive. Oh, I just don't know if like wigs are for me. I just don't think I look good and it kind of stinks. Really excited to see what people think of this one. Super excited. I'm sultry. <laughs> Whatever. Um, honestly, after I put it on, it's, it's not that bad. It's just a lot to get used to. Megan! <laughs> oh my god. This vibe is so <laughs> good. If you ever, for some reason, was like, I'm gonna dye my hair for bangs, it would work. Yeah. What, who, what is, what, oh my god, who is this woman? Oh. What do you think? I like it. You look like a rapper. <laughs> is it, no, not a bad way. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. A no rapper. rapper. <laughs> Cute. Yeah, it's very, very cute. I can. I don't think you like it. <laughs> I would look at this hair and I would wish I would have this hair, but it just feels so different on me. I'm just walking in the bathroom, I'm like, who is this person? Yeah. <laughs> what do you think? Beautiful curls. I almost reached out. <laughs> oh. oh. I just am having a trouble sometime picking out my clothes. Mm. Yeah, I don't know what my vibe is. You know what though? I think that usually you, your looks are like edgy. Mm -hmm. This one makes you a little nice. Too nice. I know, I know, you're right, you're right. <laughs> you look friendly. I'm okay. <laughs> it is the beginning of the third day. This one is the wig that we fear, <laughs> which is weird to say. Please welcome the next member of the Kardashians, Kinsey. <laughs> well, I feel like I look like Beyonce's fat sister going to church. <laughs> the length is crazy. Um, I don't even, my hair was not this long when it was long, so I'm not used to this. <sighs> this is fear day. Just gotta get out of my comfort zone. <sighs> Good lord. I don't hate it. Do you still hate it? <laughs> yeah. Why? Because this is just not me. Yeah. At all. You know what you should do? What? You should chop it all off and make it into a bob. I know, the bob would look good. I'm grabbing your... I need a side by side. <laughs> yeah, also that was me like four years ago. I like For... this one a lot. Do you? Maya, what do you think? You look like the girl next door, yeah. like the girl I always wanted to be in movies. Yeah. I know, I kind of feel like a sellout. Have, not a sellout, but like this is the hair that I feel like my younger self was like, this is all I saw in media. Yeah. So exactly. I was like... I feel like your energy is very different in the way that like you don't feel confident. Yeah, no, I don't feel confident at all. I think you need to jazzify it. Okay. okay. Yeah. I'll, I'll jazzify it. Thank you. you. Know I mean? yeah. Thank you. I got this. <laughs> I love it. This is getting the best reaction out of all of like them. It? I feel like this is the least me ever. I love it. I also love the least of it. Oh my god. I straight up was thinking, like for 30 seconds, was like, who is sitting in Jazz's desk? Oh my god. I think this might be my favorite. Oh my god. It looks real. Yeah. It looks natural and it looks smooth and beautiful. Yeah. You're gonna be treated differently in society with this hair. Oh, for sure. Do you know what I mean? With this whole look. Can we go take photos? Yeah. 
I like truly don't know who this girl is. My back hurts also after this. This is a lot. I was the most afraid of this wig because it seemed very like typical plus size model beautiful. That's totally a beautiful look, but it's just nothing that I've ever experienced. So I'm excited for these next two days because I think I can get into being a little bit more me. I do keep getting the urge to just pull my wig off in public. <laughs> <laughs> Tomorrow we get to wear whatever wig we want. I cannot for life me decide which one I want to wear again. To be honest, I don't want to wear any of them again. Kinsey Kardashian signing off. <gasps> it's so good, Ryan. I do love so it. So good. Oh, I see. I miss my blonde. This is nice. I miss the blonde. Yeah. Got my outfit on. It's a little athleisure look. And to be honest, I feel so good in this wig. I'm excited to have like a do-over day. And I'm wearing it out tonight. Yeah! Day four, I went with the purple wig. I'm just wearing my favorite t-shirt, my NSYNC one, and just some jeans. All right, so I tied it back and I just put a little scrunchie. I'm loving this. I really, really am loving this. <laughs> Can I help you? So you put on this wig and you would do Mm -hmm. Your multiracial don't crack because you look like you're like 14 with this. I like this. Uh -huh. I don't know why you put a hat on it the first time. Because I don't like the black hairline. I like it because it kind of just like ombres into it. Yeah. What do you think of my hair today? I like it. The purple's very you. Really? I like it a little more than the black. Yeah? Okay. Wow, she's a 90s girl. I'm a 90s girl. So we're going to dinner, wearing our wigs. We're going for a Korean barbecue. Uh, we'll see how this goes. Also see what Sissy thinks. Yeah. <laughs> You're horrible! I'm not mad about it. It brings out the blue in your eyes and your complexion. I love jazz. The texture is so good. You yes. just came back from Barbados or something. Ooh, I'll take it. <laughs> How do you feel? <laughs> no one knows who I am here anyway, so yeah. it's not like people think I look any different. I think this was my uh, most confident day yet. I wasn't creating myself based on my hair, I was creating myself just based on me yeah. today. <laughs> Today is the last day of wearing the wigs. My first three days that I wore these wigs, I was matching outfits to the wigs. So I don't wanna dress for the wigs anymore. I'm gonna dress for me and just wear the wigs. Last day. First of all, I realized this is my favorite wig. It just, for some reason, still just feels like me. Sweatshirt, jacket, super cute. And then I just have um, denim pants to match. I'm into it. This is what I'm wearing today. The wig, obviously, and some leggings. It's a little bit more me. It's just so different, but um, I feel so much more confident. Wig has been holding up great. <laughs> I, I, it's not as windy as I thought, even though we're by the water, but um, you know, except for the occasional um, hair that flies into Curly's mouth, like it looks pretty good. I think your outfit works perfectly with this wig. Yeah. I think this is you. I think this is a jazz classic. She loves the animal print. Okay. This is like you, like when you know you get married and like your FICO score goes up to 900. Ooh. And you're just ready. Okay. What's happening? I don't know. Your blonde is showing. Oh my god, it feels so good coming off my head. I wish. Sorry, but it's like. So it's the end of the day. I have successfully done it. In celebration, Maya is going to snatch the wig off my head. Give me my money. <laughs> this challenge of wearing wigs for a week really did challenge me um, to step out of my comfort zone a lot more. For anybody that's like looking to change things up, you can do that, you know? Like, we aren't subjected to just one look. Yeah, I definitely think I'm gonna wear wigs again and not be so afraid. Oh. oh. 
I look so different without hair. I'll be keeping this around though. I'll be keeping this around. <laughs> the pigtails don't work for you. I'm this so is, sorry. Um, first of all, I don't know what the f you're talking about. Yes, it does. <laughs>